Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Jehovah. Thank you, the I am that I am. You are the creator. You are our Lord. You are the master of the universe. You are the king of the whole world. You are the king of Israel. You are the glory of Israel. The God of Abraham, the God of Isaac, the God, the God of Jacob. Let your name be worshipped. Let your name be exalted. We bow down before you today. We worship you today in supplication. We lift your name above every other name. We exalt your name because you are our God. You are our creator. It's by your spirit that we are living. It's by your spirit that we are alive. You are the spirit of all flesh. You are the spirit of all mankind. You are the God of all flesh. You are the spirit of prophets. The all wise God. The all knowing God. The ever present God. Omnipresent. Omniscient. Omnipotent. We worship you. We bow down before you. You are our maker. You are our creator. You are our ruler. Take our praises today. And take our adoration. Holy Spirit. The spirit of truth. The spirit of life. Jesus Christ, the name that is above every other name, you are the Savior. Take all praises today, deliver us today, save us today with your power. Let your blood set us free from every sin. Let every sin in our life be run away by the blood of Jesus Christ. This is morning cry coming to you from Save the World Christian Ministry, a ministry with a divine mandate to set the captives free and give sight to the blind by the power in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. My name is Dr. Babatope Babalobi. And I shall be sharing from Matthew chapter 27, verse 3. Then Judas, which had betrayed him, when he saw that he was condemned, repented himself, and brought again the thirty pieces of silver to the chief priests and elders. Judas betrayed Jesus. Of course, it's a popular story. He betrayed Jesus because of 30 shekels of silver. He betrayed Jesus because of a monetary reward. As you go out today, decide that you will not betray anyone because of money or because of any other gratification. Decide you will do the right thing. Judas refused to do the right thing. And you know, it, he never eventually benefits from the money of betrayer, from the gift of betrayer, from the reward of betrayer. If you read that those verses, he threw the money to the chief priests. And those chief priests again and there, that they threw the money to the temple because the money originally belonged to God in any case. Judas didn't benefit from the reward of sin. He committed sin, he betrayed. As you go out today, decide you shall not betray your supervisor, you shall not betray your company, you shall not betray your husband, you shall not betray your wife, you shall not betray your children by doing something that is evil that is wrong, that is wicked. Decide to do what is right. And don't, be, you just betray Jesus because of money. Don't betray your faith in God because of money. You a lady, you a woman. Don't betray your integrity, your virtues because of money. A man is enticing you with money, with gifts. He's taking out, buying things for you. Don't betray your God because of money, because of the gifts he's giving you. Don't cheat on your wife. Don't cheat on your husband. Don't betray your husband. Don't fool a string man because of money, because of power, because of position, because of status. You want to be promoted in the office and you are following a string, a, a string man. Don't betray your wife. Don't betray your, your wedding, your marriage covenant by following that lady. A string lady, a Jezebelic lady. Don't betray God. Don't betray your family. Don't betray your husband. Don't betray your company. Do what is right. Do what is right. Judas lost his position as an apostle. He wept. At the end of the day, he, 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 he committed suicide. The sin of betrayer is bitter. There is a way that seemeth right to a man, but the end thereof are the ways of death. You shall not betray your God. You shall not betray your Savior. You shall not betray your family name. You shall not betray your company. You shall not betray your husband. You shall not betray your wife. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. You shall not commit evil. You shall not betray even that university that you are working by. By indulging in plagiarism. You shall not betray your faith in God. Stand for the truth. Money shall not cause you to be a betrayer. 
rewards, gifts shall not cause you to be a betrayer. Status, positions shall not cause you to be a betrayer. Be a person of integrity. Hold on to your faith, to your God, to your Jesus. Do not be a betrayer because the reverse of betrayer is destruction. You shall not be destroyed. It is well with you. Heaven shall rejoice over you. And Satan shall not rejoice over you. In Jesus' mighty name, amen.